One of the biggest concerns about COVID-19 is the aerosolization of viral particles and the potential for infection of healthcare providers and staff. Globally, we have tragically seen healthcare providers succumb to this disease after being infected while on the job. It is of utmost importance that we protect our healthcare workers, especially in the face of the current supply chain disruptions. We believe that we have a novel solution for this problem. The CRS supply air system provides air to the three devices which were demonstrated earlier today. Through a fan and a filtration system, it is delivered to a four inch main running the length of the ward where each bedside will have its individual takeoff for supply air. In addition to this, there is a line running pure oxygen equally down the length of the ward, each bedside also having its own T. The oxygen supply will allow for boosting of the oxygen in the air to each of the patients in the beds, we can raise the FiO2 up to 0.5 by injecting pure oxygen. The air supply manifold is paired with an exhalation containment system, which serves an equal number of patients. It collects exhaled air immediately after it exits the patient and thus mitigates any risk to the surrounding people. The air is then transported to a wet scrubber, which utilizes mechanical and chemical means to inactivate the virus. The air is then released back into the room after it has been treated. This method for treating the air allows us to optionally add a filter. However, this is not completely reliant on this in the event of a supply chain disruption or other restrictions. The CRS system can be run by a single person in front of a control panel at one end of the ward. This panel contains switches for energizing or de-energizing the two fans, also for monitoring the temperature and air pressure of the fans and the pressure of the air in the mains, that's the supply main, and in the scavenging main. 